Now, multiplying these guys shouldn't be too bad if you remember the formula that we had just written in one of the other videos. Remember that these guys, the way that they are written, happen to fall into the formula that would give us the difference of two squares. Right? Yes. So according to that, it would be the square root of 93 squared minus what? Square root of 71 squared. Now, what do you think is going to happen if you were to square a square root? <laughs> Those guys basically cancel each other out. They're inverse operations for the most part when you have a restricted domain of just positive values. So that guy's also going to reduce away. So what do you really have here? 93 minus 71. You have 93 minus 71, which is just what? <coughs> That's just 22, right? So knowing that difference of squares formula is very useful to you. But you've got to be careful about what you're doing, though. If I have 12 minus the square root of 62 times 12 plus the square root of 62. Do I get to use the difference of squares formula here? No, no because one has the oh. Remember, you have to look for what we call conjugates. Are the first terms the same? Yes. Yeah. Are the second terms the same except for a sign? Yeah. Then that falls into this formula that we have here for the difference of squares. Which means when I write this, you want to make sure that you do write the formula correctly. This is 12 squared minus the square root of 62 squared. Now notice here that I actually have to square 12. 12 is not being protected from the squaring. See, the square root kind of protects you a little bit. This guy has no protection, so what happens when you square 12? 144. You get 144 minus, 62. now over here, the 62 has some protection, right? He had some protection, so when the square comes, the square will destroy the house. But the 62 is okay, right? But what if the indices are the two and not the same? If the indices are not the same, you're not going to be able to do that. And we're not going to really see examples like that. Not right now. So then what's 144 minus 62? 82. 82. Those are cool.